Test one, two, three. Hello, everybody. Hello, Papo. Um, we're loading all the stuff. Popping out that chat. Can you guys hear me? Um, has it been a while? I, I've been streaming on Twitch more this week. So, you know, I'm just... I'm ever present in many places. If you want to see me, it's easy to find me. It is not hot. But you know what is easy? Is if it's cheesy. It ain't gonna go down easy if it ain't cheesy. Alright. I put on that monster cat music that I know I have a license to. Praise... Praise YouTube God. Uh, if we were on Twitch, we could actually listen to whatever I want, but since we're not, well, we got Monster Cat, which is all right. You don't have Twitch? Oh man, if only there were some easy solution to that problem. Ah, I guess it'll just go un unsolved. But that's okay, we're here on YouTube. YouTube's better anyways. Less ads. Alright. This is our dude. I spent yesterday figuring out how this guy's eyeballs work. Um, so that I could paint them. And I spent today, this morning, going over the UVs again. So let's get to it. Um, let me get my ref sheet up. I even though it's an Avali ref sheet, I still use it. That way you guys can see too, kind of what I'm basing things off of. We're gonna make this like fox, cat, kimono critter kind of look like me. That's the objective. Let me know if the music is too loud or too unloud. Oh, uh, one more thing I need to do. Uh. Oh, people, pop, people, pop, people, pop. Everyone doing okay out there today? People, pop, people, pop, people, pop. Alright, I think I've got most of the stuff I need. If everything works out today, maybe we could have this in VR chat today. Yeah, I'll try to get a, go at a good pace. Everything's online. I've got my bow tie. I've got my kitty cat ears and my kitty cat glasses. And my... All my... My my, my dude is here. My brushies. Strema engaged. I wish somebody would engage my Strema. Actually, I wish everyone would engage my Strema. Um, this is my first time streaming art on YouTube, so this will be a pretty big experiment. Basketball game? I sure hope it does. Cat wear. A, a cat? No way. Alright, first thing I'm gonna do here is we're gonna give ourselves a little bit of height. 
And I'm just going to paint this out. Um, I want my ref sheet. Where is it? I always keep it right on my desktop. This is going to be really fun, I think. It'll take a long time to blink? What do you mean? I, ha I made alphas for myself mm, a pretty long time ago. There we go. How am I today? Um, you know, I breathe oxygen in and carbon dioxide is still coming out and I had some coffee. So, uh, I think I'm doing all right. I also had a little chocolate donut. Well, really more of a chocolate covered donut. I messed up. There we go. Fresh. I might redo it later. Don't really like how it blurs there. Maybe um, I'll do it as a UV, so like... Like the pink is fine, but... Ah.
We gotta get the big stuff going. <laughs> yeah, I just sneeze sometimes. I don't really like how it's curving around. Oof, that's weird. Eh, that's better. Kinda just depends on I'm kind of a perfectionist, so getting it exactly right is really important to me. Like that, I don't really like how that happens, so... Probably gonna go with the UV way. Let me try, uh, planner. Nah, we're gonna do the UV way. Find that I use the UV method more and more. Looks pretty good. I think that's as good as it's gonna get. There we go. It's just the part of the one of the symbols that goes on the back of my character. <sighs> Neo, quick question. When you play games like Minecraft or something, do you drink anything? Um, I drink water, coffee, um, etc. I don't know. It's not really anything specifically Claws. This is something we made up for my character a long time ago. Cool. It's really fun how texturing a character can like really quickly just bring them to life.
Pop Tart? I I guess. Do you guys want to Yelp review my YouTube streams? Let me know if you find this interesting or if this was a stupid idea. I thought this would be interesting. Kind of don't like. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna do this again. It's gotta, it's gotta be perfect. You like it. That's what matters, Walter Ross. Welcome, lighthearted. I have so many of these alphas. Ew. There's a UV seam right here. I actually redid butt texturing. I can I'll texture the butt later. Don't worry, we'll get there. There's like there's, oops, you made me misclick. There's definitely a little bit. I mean, it's just a, like a little kimono butt. There's not a lot of ass here. Like, if you guys were, like, looking for, like, the fat cheeks, they're not really here, but there's something. It's a cute character. It looks a lot bigger if I turn the the, per, the view from perspective to orthographic. That's kind of funny. I think that's probably as good as I'm gonna get it. Let's make it bigger. We gotta make it emissive, right? Cause it ain't gonna go down easy if it ain't cheesy. All right, the back and the shoulders are done. I might add something down here. I don't know.
Ugh. The sus tribe stamp. <laughs> Not again! <laughs> it's gotta be perfect. Puts a sus of mocus on his butt. <laughs> I had to approve one of the messages. Uh, that is an excellent Among Us. What do you mean? It's a perfect Among Us. I'm probably gonna remove it when we're done. I said it's gonna hide out there for a while. What's up, Harbus? Uh, I haven't forgotten about the stuff you want. I just wanted to do this on YouTube today. Trying, trying to do different things. We're differently different. You know what I just realized? Big, 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 stupid problem. Not in symmetry mode. No rush. I know, but I have to be courteous of like everyone who's in my commission queue. So I can't, I can't just keep everyone on hold. I've got a lot of commissions I need to do. I have considered doing substance tutorials. Um, there's there's honestly a few Blender, Unity, and substance tutorials that I could be doing. Uh, I just need to do them. Yeah, yeah. I actually, I redid the UV for this model, Harvest. Uh, I made it a little bit more optimal. Because, I mean, this is just kind of a theory. I don't really know what goes on in the mind of like kimono avatar makers but it, it i feel like the uv was like designed to like be painted on in photoshop really easily and i don't really use photoshop did i make the alphas for fur no this is from gumroad these you could buy these from gumroad don't make a lopsided thigh gap uh not sure. Oh. <laughs> I'm actually a criminal. But no, I did not make these alphas. You you buy them online. C 
covers eyes. <laughs> me, I want to do a serious, like, substance painting stream. Also, me, what if I paint Among Us on the model? That is hilarious, Harbus. Maybe I'll do that. There is some space on the back of the eyes that could hide in Among Us. Thanks, Scout Ying. Yeah, do you like the Neo Cat? The Neo Cat's pretty good. Man, this used to take me a lot longer. I think I've gotten a lot more confident with this stuff. Put a nose. There's a nose. We'll, we'll be painting the nose later.
thank you, Zavellis. Where are you coming from? Have you been here before, or...? Among Us. Oh, okay. Smell you later. Hello, Blaze. Welcome. How long have I been doing art stuff? Uh, I don't know. I kind of... I textured an avatar last year, and then I did my own face tracking, like, last year on the Tiger Bee, and ever since then I've just been doing random stuff. I hope to come out with my own models someday. Oh, that's not good. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, uh, this is. I might as well just paint this manually. Switching to manual mode. I don't even think it's been a year. Making or texturing a model? Um, no. I mean, like, like technically no, because anybody can like open up Substance and like make a black mask and start drawing all over the model, you know. But like making it good, maybe. But I also think that like a lot of stuff, um, that like publishes in VR chat and passes as like quote unquote good in VR chat is not really that hard. But that might be a hot take. Like like that might like like I think that like the professional like 3D standard is a little bit different, like a higher caliber to make than like what usually people pass as like quote unquote good in like a VR chat VTuber environment, but that's very subjective. So is it hard to paint a model? No. Is it hard to paint a VTuber and maybe most people will like it. Maybe a little bit. Is it hard to like make a character that would pass in like maybe a AAA environment or a movie environment? Yes. <laughs> those are all, <laughs> but all of those things are like a similar pipeline. <laughs> so, so it's, it's very subject. Do I do 2D art? Not really. I used to draw in high school, but I don't know. My only interest in drawing right now is making concepts for things that I would want to model later. Um. So like, eh.
This is the best. This is the best brush in the game, by the way. You could do everything with this brush. These these like wet brushes right here, like the wet hard brush, the wet hard soft brush, the the wet soft brush. These are all. These are the best brushes in the game right here, S tier. You gotta go? You mean you can't just camp my stream all day long and give me millions of view hours? How dare you? Doing like a little bit of detailing right here. I should get something that shows you guys the shortcuts I'm using when I'm doing this. There we go. You love my channel? Well, thank you. I love my channel too. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if my sense of humor is sometimes unironically seen as toxic. I, I promise I'm just joking. Uh, the speed run idea. Looking good. Yeah, it takes a little detail work. Now we get to do the magenta. There it is. All done. I'm just kidding. Uh, I'm thinking. Yeah, that looks cool, right? I'm so I'm trying to do it like my ref sheet. So hold on. Um, my ref sheet is obviously in a volley, but this is what it looks like, right? Cat, cat, kitty, cat, cat. 
So I'm trying to make it look like there's some some sort of like painterly detailing there, you know. I'm trying to art really hard, guys. I want to be more than just a nitwit waste of oxygen streamer. I want to make things. Paints myself 100 times. Look at it. Look at it. I want you all to look at it. But yeah. Um, anyways. Oh, yeah. Yeah. See, do you I'm trying to make it like the ref sheet. Does that make sense? What's up, Billy man? What kind of avatar am I texturing? This is uh, Minecraft Steve from Super Smash Bros. Uh, but on a more serious answer, Blaze, this is the Ferna. Um, if you look at the beginning of the description for the live stream, you can get a link to this model. But I have modified the model a little bit. I changed all the UVs, so it's not going to be exactly the same. And I also custom made a... a substance environment for it so it will not if you buy this it will not be the same i mean the model will be the same but it comes with the psd it doesn't come with substance so you have to do all that yourself that's relatable it's in a in a case i'm bad at things too i just do them for a really really long time until i randomly accidentally do something that doesn't suck why is there an among us uh, emergency meeting. What was I doing? Yeah, there's not really a reason for that. Honestly, Substance Painter is one of the 3D programs of all time. Well, I painted the Among Us to protect myself from being murdered by the imposter and from emergency meetings disrupting my work. So, it's optimal. It's a little sus, but ultimately it's for my own protection, you know? You're playing Among Us while watching the stream? 
That's kind of sus. Homework? I sure hope it does. died well just don't die All right, how does this look? Does that get a, is that a maybe? Is that plausible? Cause I think that looks all right. Yeah, it, it looks aight. It looks aight. TBH, I think that I should make a new layer. Copy layers. Clear mask. The popping color should be a little different, maybe. the pause I know this is where the value is We gotta make them a little shiny looking. Hug of nails, yeah, beans. I'm also gonna go to the claws. We gotta make the claws brilliant. What the? Uh oh. Okay, I was worried that was a UV issue. Maybe it is a UV issue? Holding tight while it 
Hmm. Oh, yeah, it's a little close here. It'll be okay. I'll figure it out. We'll use the polyfill tool. Are you guys having a good vibe? I'm having a good vibe. Okay, that looks good. Now we gotta do the feet. Now, uh, Substance doesn't let me... Do I stream on Twitch? Oh! Doll oh, baby, do I? <laughs> yes, I'm a Twitch partner. I've been streaming on Twitch for years. Whoa. <laughs> Yes, we must color the feet. Feet will be colored now. I've decided that the beans should be slightly emissive. If it turns out to be too much later, we can always turn it off. It also makes them easier to paint. Now this is content. Paint the beans. Okay, so clearly uh, I should give up everything else I'm streaming and just always paint beans. Do not tickle the feet. No, no. This is the- this is my reference bean, by the way. This is what I'm using as a reference. People are dumb in Among Us? No, uh, no way. That- that could never happen. No way. People stupid? In a- in Among Us? Um, among Us? Sauce? Imposter? Never. What is that? I think that might be a little bit of the claws. Erase the Among Us? Uh, if you subscribe, I'll erase the Among Us. And by subscribe, I mean member. So, this reference is for Maya Volley. Maya Volley has claws on the feet. This model does not. That's okay. It's just kind of a guideline. Well, I'm not following it exactly. Do 
By the way, you guys doing okay out there? Is the music and all right? And in the volume and everything doing all right? I think YouTube was glitching for me. YouTube told me that almost everyone left for a second. And I was like, is everything okay out there? <laughs> I'm like, huh? Your face is chilling. All right, we got to color the mouth. Um. Can I just make a new group? The mouth. Sudden mass. Yeah, it was like, no, but don't do Vor here. Listen, listen. I draw the line at Vor. But little critter furry friends getting lots of food and being comfy shaped is valid, but I draw the line at Vor. No, no. Eating lots of cake and just having a good time, that's valid, but we don't do Vor in my community, all right? There's nothing against it, it's just not my thing. Except for when we played all of Tribal Hunter, but I that, that was kind of the one time. And even then, it was it was video game comic-y kind of, you know, it's just, yeah. Anyways, let me get that mouth. So we got two choices for the mouth here. Can either do the the super duper shiny gamer cyan mouth, or that. Um, tra the traditional squishy lick. Hmm. Options. My answer to that, Justinator number four, is don't be weird. Take it somewhere else. <laughs> if you want to be the cake, go somewhere. Take it somewhere else away from me. TBH, I'm thinking, I'm thinking Shades of Cyan. So what we need to do is, I need like a couple Shades of Cyan here. Let's see here. We'll start with the darkest one. Uh, we'll make that a missive. TBH, I should have separated the mouth bag from the character, but we'll figure it out. Not cyan. This is... We're not going to make it green. Now, when you're painting with a missive, you have to be careful because it... It it's kind of stacks up. It piles up. So... Yeah. This must be the mouth. Green and pink. No. All right, we also need a teeth color. Now, I know that perfectly white teeth are not realistic, but I don't care. I want mostly white teeth, so... Um... We'll just go based on the teeth that I have. Ah! 
All right. Um, are, are these the teeth? Question mark? No, that's not the teeth. You know, animating this character's face might be tricky, but that's okay. I have to do that later. Because they've got, like, no... Like, their mouth is so itty-bitty, man, with these anime characters. Yeah, painting inside the mouth is difficult. I know some of you out there are probably really glad that I'm inside the mouth like this. You're having the adventure of your lifetime. I'm just trying to do some dentistry work in here. I'm just trying to paint the teeth. Okay, don't make it weird. The other ones had even smaller muzzles, Fish preferred, but you're kind of right. I've got a single pixel there. Okay, well, that's just gonna have to stay the same. I kind of expected minor UV issues like that to appear, but it's so small, I don't think anyone will notice. Like, it is really itty bitty.
fascinated? I sure hope so. By the way, if you guys chat more often, YouTube will think my streams are good. It's just like that episode of Spongebob where they are, uh, they, they try to form a band and Squidward's like, Maybe if we play loud, people will think we're good. Except instead of people, it's YouTube, and instead of playing loud, it's you guys chatting a lot. God, God bless it's in a case. Hell yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Shadow! Help! Just like uh, that it's in a case that is a really weird thing to say in somebody's chat if you want to watch another streamer that's fine but like keep the reason to yourself like that's just not it is socially I'll just be blunt it is socially bankrupt to be like hello I like somebody better than you so peace out like just just keep it to yourself! There's no reason I need to know that! Like, that's just keep it to yourself! <laughs> hey, this keeps happening! The reason I'm yelling about it is because it keeps happening. It's like that meme. They, you can't keep getting away with this! Like, like, <laughs> it just... Ah! You know what? If we make good time today, I will try to get this going in VR chat as soon as possible, Blaze the Wolf. To, but to be honest, I, I don't know if my UV changes are going to make Unity mad or not, so it's kind of a big maybe. Trying to like get the tongue to look like a certain way, and it's tough. I wonder if it would be easier to do this in the two dimensions. Which of these things is the tongue? It's fun. 
Okay, this is the tongue. Okay, okay, okay. This is now, now this is easy. So I just need to go like this. My most favorite, uh, the Avali that I don't have yet. Probably. After that, I don't know, Amp Wave? Maybe? It's a tough decision. I am really, like, I'm not an incredible artist or anything. I just keep clicking on it until it looks the way I want. That's how I do art, I guess. All right, I'm going to use cheat codes. Where's the funny button? Uh, okay, I guess I can't do it like that. Um, add a black mask. No. Add a white mask. And a filter blur. <sighs> you think so? Review other people's avatars? Uh, I don't know. Do you guys like that I named the folder the mouth? I am really good at making other people's models into me. <laughs> I don't know if that's a marketable skill, but perhaps someday it could be.
What is that? That's weird. Man, why is it purple there? I mean, you can like show it off in our Discord server if you really want to. Wonder if it's because I have blur on. Yeah, there's definitely a weird spot right here. Don't really know what's causing that. I mean, it's so dark that like Yeah, okay. I might be just I might just be kind of going goofy. I think that's about as good as I can get it. If it needs to be redone after putting like decent shading on it and stuff, then it is what it is. But for a cartoon mouth, I think that's all right. Maybe like, I like, No, I'm not a furry. Definitely not. No way. Uh, when I'm looking for avatars, like for other people's models to 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 get for myself, uh, it's gotta have good IK. Like when I move around, good weight painting, good, good um, full body movement, and. The face has to have a lot of room to have expression and mapped to it. Or be very expressive. But also, I try to look for things that other people aren't already using. So, like, I avoid really, really hyper popular models now, I guess. 
I like to stand out. It's very important for my dopamine levels to be able to stand out from the rest. I'm making I'm making a do a big think right now. Alright, we gotta make the nose now. It's gotta be magenta, right? I think the nose is like Part of the body? There might not be a lot of UV space on this snoz. It's kind of my fault. That's a little unfortunate. Hmm. Time for some feathering. helps I think remember um, a while ago that brush I told you guys could do everything This is it. <gasps> Endeavor, thank you so much! How come that's not playing an alert? Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Damn, YouTube kind of took a massive chunk of that. Jeez. Well, it'll be about the same as Twitch. TBH. But yeah, the schnoz. What's up, Blizzball? I haven't gotten to hang out with you in a while lately. Sorry I've been so busy. I feel kind of bad. This is kind of a silly problem to have right now. Eh, 
I'll try to fix it later, maybe, but for now, I think that's as good as it could be. Nah, it's fine, Endeavor. Thank you. I'm glad the alerts look work now. I've always been like, I've been juggling weird YouTube alert problems last few streams, but it seems like it's alright now. The brows. Slowly, this character's coming together. It's coming along. Sorry, I was taking a moment to think. Holy frick! Dude! YouTube had better play the alert this time. I'm waiting for it. There it is! Oh my god, okay, it just takes longer. Thank you so much, Lighthearted! Yay! Oh, I guess people have to confirm it? That's the first time anyone's ever done that on our YouTube channel. What does that look like from your guys' point of view? I want to know. Do you guys like get like a pop-up and you have to like click on it? What does that look like? Oh, did you get one, Shadow? Oh, dude, that means you get- you get 20 tummy rub animations. Oh, that is the- that- hell yes. Thank you so much! 
Yeah, the belly rubs. That's right. People, people support me financially. That means I get tummy rubs for sure. That's a good vibe, right? I like that. I like that for me, and I like that for you guys. I need a folder. Congratulations on, uh, oh, I see. So you have to, unlike Twitch, you have to consent to it. I kind of like that better, actually, because, like, Twitch is, like, when you, when people gift subs on Twitch, it kind of is, like, turbo random. On here, it seems like you have to consent to it. Yeah, I'm wondering what happens if they don't say yes. <laughs> like, maybe you get the money back or something. That would be interesting. Thank you so much, Lighthearted. Um, what what part of the Avatar should I do next? Cause like there's a lot. There's a lot to go. Also, our maximum time today is like five or six hours. I'm not going any longer than that. That's our maximum. No matter no matter what happens, that is our max time. Because if you go longer than six hours, stupid stuff happens. Um, I'm thinking. I think we should do the legs. Those leggies. Them leggers. The Legos. The Leggies. That would- I would prefer if it went to people in chat. That would be awesome. But it's kind of an experiment. We never- I've never gotten to experience that before. Uh, what do you mean by the stupid VOD thing? Yeah, if a stream is long, it goes, uh, reaches six hours, then YouTube doesn't like it, so. Ew. That was weird. Why did it do that? What the fuck? <laughs> Huh? I am not sure what I'm gonna do with the tail, but I could do the tail. That's better. Okay. I was like, what's going on here? I will have to make something up for the tail, which is fine.
Whoops. I might not use this in the long run. I might make a new design. It's kind of a maybe. It's pretty colorful though. But it's just a little too... It's a little too painterly. Hmm. Uh, we could try making something for the tail, but I just I have to, I have to think really hard, because my ref sheet doesn't actually have any tail designs on it. I'll just make something up. Oh yeah, Among Us is here. It's okay, Among Us. You can stay there for a little longer. Can you tickle my feet? Well, normally, um, as a well-adjusted neurotypical adult person would probably say, Hey, I have boundaries, um, and I don't really know you that well. You, you're a stranger. You might even be a kid. That's kind of weird. But actually, um, since I'm weird, you can tickle my feet in VR chat, for sure. Especially if you get on my tier 14 Patreon. That enables the feet tickling privileges, and we have a feet tickling session every single week. Every every week. We just get on VR chat for like two or three hours and people take turns tickling my feet. It's it's pretty awesome, but but it's not for free. You gotta you gotta be part of the premium the premium membership for that. Somebody out there is gonna take me out of context and cancel me for monetizing weirdness. No jokes allowed in this fandom. Uh, although, part of me is not against the idea of of a paid furry feet tickling session. That, that could help me afford flight school. See, in the last, like, 40 seconds, I just, like, battled, like, eight different inner demons. <laughs> I wonder how many people out there are like, are y'all joking or, or, or is this, so hmm. <laughs> See, are you sad because my jokes are a little on the nose or are you sad that you don't think that there's a feet tickling session? Or are you sad that it's not free? <laughs> I just went ha ha <laughs>
Oh, so you've got the YouTube membership now. Now you can now you can enter the feet tickling session. There you go. We used to have a catchphrase around here. Uh, don't be weird. I'm not sure what I want to do with the tail. Congratulations on your membership, though. Okay, I think I kind of know what I want to do with the tail uh, after thinking about it a little bit. I do have to say I'm sorry it's taking so long, but I had to I had to really think. Hell yeah, we do. Every time, does every time somebody accepts it, does the animation replay? It does. Every time somebody accepts it, it does replay. <laughs> Have you know who Rail the Protogen? The Rail the Protogen. Protogen. Rail the. That's how I. Uh, that's what I think. That's that's your answer. Have, have you know who Rail the Protogen?
I might like blend this differently later. I don't know, I'm kind of unsure about this. I have done some collabs with Rail. Uh, I've literally been in Rail's videos, and he has a clip of me on a really popular short on his channel. And I've I've hung out with him a lot in the past. We're not doing a lot of stuff right now, but it's mostly because I'm just really busy. We're all really busy. So yes, I I have heard of Rail the Protogen. I've heard of Pseudo the Protogen. I've heard of Mr. Bubbles. I've heard of Beta Ada Delata. All of the super duper popular stream of people, the protogens, God bless the protogens and their Windex and their beeping. I've, I've, I've heard of them and I've met them. Please put me in a blender as soon as possible. I deserve it. Thinking about coloring the underside of the tail, like I did with old avatars. Oh, that's weird. Is that a bean? Got it. Have you heard of Ritual Neo? That's what everyone should be asking. Everyone should be asking, have you heard of Ritual Neo? It's really, really easy to meet me in VR chat. At least it used to be. I don't really get get on public eat as much as I used to. Yeah, in the past, I kind of had like a well-defined like, like patterns I would use for my tail and stuff, but I'm not really feeling that right now. So I have to make up something new, which is tough. Have you make a protogen? I had a protogen. I commissioned a protogen a long time ago, but I don't actively use it right now. I think that there are enough protogens in the world. Don't you guys think so? We got enough protogens.
What did Fish say? Not enough Mama Gens? Maybe. This isn't really the place to talk about other streamers unless expressly invited to as a reminder. Okay, guys? Like, if a streamer is a friend of mine and it's like a nice fun topic, maybe. But like bringing up other streamers over and over again is kind of making me a little tilted. Like, it normally happens a little bit, but today it's happening a lot. So I'm just kindly telling you guys explicitly and bluntly and directly because I know some of y'all with the social cues, it just is a massive whoosh. But like, stop bringing up other streamers. Is now is not the time. Unless I bring it up, just quit doing it. Just quit, just cut it out. Just stop. Just don't. And be here, be present in what we are doing right now as, as, as a community. Like it doesn't, I don't know what, what it is about today. Maybe like the Sunday, you know, the, the, it's, it's football day, but like, damn. Is anybody confused about what I'm saying? It's not an exact block, it's like a soft block, so like the block, it looks like a brick, right? But it's really like more like a gradient. So I, I just like these like wet brushes kind of for this. I don't know, I'm trying to figure out something that I haven't really painted before. This is a little bit of a learning process for me. Well, that's cool. I like that. There we go.
This will look really cool if I turn on a little bit of metallic, I think. I think. Whoa! Wait! Doggo, is that you? There is gonna- there is an alert, but it's gonna take a minute. Oh my god, thank you, Doggo! You do not squish me! Also, I love your- your red panda icon. Uh, Fish Preferred says, has YouTube been reasonable with your stream earnings so far? I have never- I haven't really been docked. No weird stuff happened. The only weird things that have happened with our YouTube channel are, um, the, uh, endoparasitic streams were marked as unsuitable because of violence for, like, like a day? But I didn't even complain or do anything, and YouTube set them back to normal, and then, like, YouTube kinda didn't like a lot of stuff in that, um, in that Rick and Morty game, so I just decided that mo that VOD is, is go bye-bye, sorry. I don't think anybody's gonna deeply miss it. It's kind of a lesson. Artists' rights to their IPs in the furry community when it comes to original species. Uh, that's a touchy subject. I think that, um... Mm. I think that there is not a lot to stop somebody from making their own mishmash of, of stuff and making an original species of their own any way they want. Uh, if they just don't directly copy somebody else and that a lot of stupid issues can be avoided by just doing that. I think I want to do this, but they just need to be bigger. Hmm. Yeah. TBH, I can't wait till we get onto the jacket and the eyes and stuff. These thighs are just the right size, Harbus. I think that they're just right.
Noticing that the wet hard is better for erasing. My YouTube playlist is gone! Okay, there we go. Alright, I need to keep in mind how long have we been going. It's been like... Two hours, okay. I probably want to speed up a little bit. Because I can't just keep doing this forever. This song is a good vibe. You know, I was thinking about uh, how I've kind of ADHD steamrolled my way through 3D and like my transition as like a streamer. Like we went from like, like kind of being a, many years ago I was like trying to do esports and being not a furry, like just a normie, you know, with a green screen and stuff, just my fleshy human face. And I went from that to being like a Beat Saber VTuber person. And we might do Beat Saber again someday. But like... I'm thinking about... How... It would take a massive amount of courage to just drop everything you're doing and do like 3D crap. Like it's risky, you know, it's... It's kind of audacious. Just be like, okay, I... I'm doing 3D now. I've like dropped everything, but I kind of definitely sidelined Beat Saber really hard. I got a little disappointed in the way Beat Saber was going, among other things. The flesh tuber, yeah. You guys don't know this, but I've actually been on Twitch since like maybe well, a really long time. A really long time, but I've only been Ritual Neo for like over three years. Oh, yeah! Blue Zest knew me as, like, a flesh tuber and a, uh, like, there was a brief period of time where I used face rig and it had this, like, white fox character. That was a long time ago. So 
I'm kind of experimenting here. I think I want to do something different and come back to the tail because I'm more confident with the other parts of my character because I have, I have alphas for them from ahead of time. Would I ever go back to face rig? Uh, I don't think there's a good reason to. This is kind of weird. Hmm. Bizarre. Have to figure that out later. Yeah, I don't really want to do face rig or animes. I'm, I'm happy. Well, I'm not really happy. Actually, I find VC face to have its own quirks and problems too. And by extension, VTuber plus, like all of the VTuber apps kind of annoy me, but but VC face is kind of the best that there is right now for 3D, so it just it is what it is. Why? Oh yeah, I'm in poly mode. I do have an amp wave actually. Do you guys want to see it? Amp wave has full facial tracking too. It's a good vibe. Uh, face rig also had like massive performance problems and making a face rig avatar is really really hard work uh so yeah it's a species Me too, Silver Flotus. Me too.
On Hamster Wave. No! You know what? Fork you on Hamster Wave. On YouTube, we have to replace the F-bomb with the with the word fork. Yeah, that's because it's a different FBX that we never put in uh, VC Face. Liquid made that. This one only goes on the left hand. Won't you come over? Guys, you know where you can play. We're breaking over. Fish preferred. Thank you for the membership. Um Thank you for the Thank you for the tummy rubs. Perfect. Wait, no, that's not right. You can't have overlapping emissions or else there will be stupidness in the future. There we go. Among Us. Yeah, I think that this is going to be really good with face tracking because I think the eyes are going to be really magnificent. And if not, then it is what it is. Whoops. But up, 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 but um. Or are you talking about the amp wave right now? The amp wave has a pretty good mouth. This is not going to be a perfect fit because the Avali has two fingers, so we're going to have to kind of guess. Yeah, I might have to draw this manually. That's okay. What's up, Silver? I might have to use this as a reference and draw this one manually. I just wish I knew what was the right brush to use, but that's okay.
Do your meetings have to do with a certain virtual con coming up? Uh, it's the Ferna, and if anyone wants to have the link to the avatar to get themselves, it should be in the description of this stream. What do you mean? We're we're painting a dude. Honestly, that almost looks correct. Just needs to be a little noisier. With some splashes of detail. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Sorry if there are like periods of time where I don't answer everything in chat. I'm kind of like figuring stuff out as I go. I'm not really a master of texturing yet, but I think I like this brush. Yes, I have glow in the dark. Yeah, all my avatars glow in the dark. They, 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 I don't know if you've noticed that I have kind of an aesthetic going on, but all of my avatars glow in the dark. Shadow, I hope you can forgive me for the goofiness I'm putting in your DMs right now. I- I'm just- I have to tell somebody. How are the speakers in my ears biologically possible? Well, uh, why don't you ask your mom? But like, 
Amp waves are like cyborgs or like robots, kinda. So if you really want a serious answer, there you go. So this part's tricky because the design is asymmetric to the other side of the character. Yeah, there's not a lot of biology going on with an amp wave. It's pretty robotic, I think. I'm not an expert on amp wave lore. Let's see if we can add... I want to add a cyan design here. Hell yeah, Harbus. I'll see you around. Thanks for hanging out with us.
Gun 'em down world in VR chat? I don't know what that is. So this part is tricky cuz my my arm designs are asymmetrical a little bit. Music burnout? I get life burnout, dude. I don't know. Music burnout, I just... If I get tired of music, I just turn it off. I am sometimes worried that the music I choose for streams gets repetitive, but... I... And it, mainly because I have to be really picky about what I choose because of like the copyright and stuff.
Well, I have a license for Monster Cat music. That's why I use it on YouTube like this. Trying to emulate the like semi painterly style that my that the artist did my ref sheet in takes a little skill. It's a skill issue. I think I'm doing an okay, an okay job. I'm a painter. Do you guys think I'm a painter? Cause I think I'm I'm a goofy bastard. <laughs> Most painters are. You could be a painter and a goofy bastard. Well, what do you think? Does it look like it's it's anything here or are we just making a mess? I might need to get a snack. I might need to get a protein bar or food or something. There, that'll carry my work a little bit. I'm not a silly little guy. Wait, maybe I am. Frick. Dinner at 3 p.m. PST? Nonsense. That doesn't make any sense. Somebody should send cookies to my house. All right, question. Should we add saucy body designs around the booty and the back of the thigh? Cause I think we should, but it'll take longer. Uh, 
Ah, oh, I forgot about that. Whoops. <laughs> it's gotta be in good taste. Um... Because it's funny, Robert Gardner. I might have to look at some of my old characters for inspiration of what to do with the butt here. Because Neo does not have butt designs. He has feathers. Hmm. I'm looking at some old pictures. I'm thinking. You know, actually, most of my characters don't get elaborate designs on the butt, literally, so... We might have to make something up. I'll try not to go too crazy. I don't want it to be mega turbo horribly impossibly sussy. Google, show me what to paint onto this booty. Um, here's what I'm going to do. Okay. The Kobold and the Janari have some butt. Nintendo Switch, Tramp Stamp. We could do that. I don't have like good pictures of the Ween available.
All right, here's what I got. We got this. It's kind of sharp, but maybe we could make something happen here. And we got this. There's a lot of details here. No, I did not Google that. I went my I went my old pictures and I found something. I need like more monitors. Yeah, yeah, Shadow, that's exactly. I'm, I'm not gonna play that audio on YouTube, but yes. Substance be doing an auto save. Gosh, there we go. Yep, all mouse. Uh, I have a really cheap little pad thing, but I decided that I'm too stupid for that, so. Yeah, maybe. We're doing something there.
I'm learning some things about some of these brushes. Okay, I'm gonna take a break to get a Diet Coke and a uh, and a protein bar or something. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. <sighs> I got a little protein bar and a little Diet Coke. Okay. I don't want to do this forever. So I'm going to try to go fast mode now.
What's up, Xeno Cruz? Welcome. Hey, did I see you last night in VR chat, or am I imagining that? Damn, dude, be safe. I'm like considering my references really carefully. Blizzball was showing me a picture of something that I did. So I'm trying to consider it really carefully. That's not healthy, Xeno Cruz, but you do you. I personally try not to get to the blackout level. Do you guys mind if I audibly crack open a Coke, like in an ASMR fashion, right next to the mic? Ooh. Tasty.
I think that looks plausible. I could get some Dr. Pepper. You have a free lifetime supply of Dr. Pepper? Is there a story behind that? One hundred and twenty-five twelve packs next to your desk? That deserves a picture. <laughs> that- hold on! I mean, I don't want to get like in your privacy or anything, but like, that... Sounds epic. Dude, imagine! Okay, I'm sorry this is cringe, but... Imagine how, how French-shaped I could be if I drank all that Dr. Pepper. A Dr. Pepper balloon. <laughs> A palette of Dr. Pepper. <laughs> That's really funny. I'm sorry. I can't. That's really funny. I'm just, I'm just imagining like this forklift guy and like, you know how when like utility vehicles are like moving something in the place where they're backing up. So they're like, beep, beep, beep. And it's just like, a person-sized crate of, like, Dr. Pepper. Oh my god, dude. You could give, like, a whole soccer team diabetes with that. I'm, be I'm trying to be courteous of time, but I also want to do a good job. I tend to hyper-focus on stuff like this. <laughs> Sometimes I don't realize how much time has passed. So like right now, we're like... It's been three hours. 
My utter maximum time is six, but I think we're getting there. We're getting there. The, the clothing and, and stuff won't take as long, I think. We have to do the ears. Ah, uh, color. I have it organized mostly by color with a couple things like the beans are their own. Some of the face stuff is its own. But the body designs are just the two colors. I think that looks pretty good. Ah, well, you know, Blizzball, I've been streaming for a long time. Ah, oh, yes sir, yes sir, son, yes sir, Roni. How could you forget about Mama Gents? Uh, I think this is enough butt stuff. Oh, should there be something on the back of the thighs, maybe a little bit? Hmm. What's up, Echo? What? I didn't- I didn't say anything weird. All I said is, I think I've had enough butt stuff for one day. <laughs> what did fish- Mantle Beasts? Yeah. You're eating fish, fishy sticks? Eh, this feels excessive. I don't know if I need anything down here. Maybe I'll just like, I'll just leave this area blank. Uh oh.
If we have time, I'll come back here. How about that? Because there's other parts that need to be done. I wish I got some fishy sticks. Alright, we have to do the ears and the top of the head now. And the hair. Oh my god. And the chest fluff. Dude, I don't even know what I'm gonna do for the chest fluff, TVH. It's also got these, like, shackles. Those are really cool. Yeah, I think I, I think that my thighs don't need anything extra. I've already got enough stuff going on with my butt. Sorry, I will never skip an opportunity to say something that's, like, adjacently cringe. <laughs> So, the hair is obviously going to go on top of my head, so I'm not going to waste any details here. Uh, I will, however, um, draw one thing important here, because obviously this place is not going to be seen, right? <laughs> Among us. Uh, anyways. We still have to do the hairs and the eyes and the jacket and the wingies and there's a lot left, but I'm gonna try. Uh luckily I do have an alpha for the ears. So, hopefully you guys don't think that using my alphas is cringe. There better not be people in VR asking to pat my belly. That... We can't have that. That would be degenerate. That would be cringe. Or do you guys think that's wholesome? Should I take a vote? Well, to be honest, these alphas are ripped straight from my ref sheet, so sometimes I feel bad when I use them because, like, I didn't really literally draw them. But I did pay for them! I did buy them. And it is my character, so... And I think I could draw them, it would just take longer. Yeah. I mean, when I commissioned the artist, I told him, like, this ref sheet is going to be used to make 3D characters. Um, and I have full commercial rights to it, so... And they're my characters, so, like, Lamoa. Like, that was- I made that very clear, like, I'm going to use these to make my 3D characters. Uh... 
Uh, I'm gonna do this in a different way. Oh, I see. There's no- no, there's definitely not a hidden Among Us on my- on my head. No way. Definitely not. Uh, frick. Okay. I might have to draw this manually, kinda. Maybe if I... better that's probably as good as I'm gonna get yeah my ears are all wrapped up but that's okay You know what, Blizzball? It's my fault, because I edited the UVs for this model, so... Uh... That is one- that is like 80% a skill issue on my part, because I went into the UV of this model and I was like, I want to do it my way. <laughs> I want to have it like Burger King, it's my way. It ain't gonna go down easy if it ain't cheesy. Everybody's so creative. That's going to require a little trimmage. We'll buff out those scratches. That kind of worked. Um, I might go over this with the knife tool, and by the knife tool, I mean the knife brush. that's as good as we can get it on the ears. Maybe like I could round it out a little bit here. Yeah. That like looks pretty good. I, I tend, one thing I tend to do with models is I tend to put a lot of details under the microscope that nobody will ever ever care about. Like this, this painfully drawn among us. Most people won't notice this. Yeah, that's okay. No, they they won't because it'll be hidden under the hair. <laughs> Scalp Among Us tier on Patreon when? I don't know. After the feet tickling tier. Walter, do you want me to show off this picture you sent me on stream? That's insane. I'll only do it with your permission, otherwise I'm not going to do it. Uh, 
Yeah, that's what I'm looking at. I've I've textured an ear very similar to this before, Blizzball. Amogus. All right, if you're certain, then I will do it. Also, we gotta copy this. Look at this insane amount of Dr. Pepper. The, 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 the like person and a half stack pile of Dr. Pepper. Jesus. But why? <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, let's go fast. Gotta go fast. So in the past, to do this, I think I made the flow on this really low and I did it this way. I know how to spell inner ear. So something I like to do, um, uh, is I like to give the ears a little bit of a gradient. So what I do here is get the soft. Whoops. Then, filter, blur, and you kind of just do this. Okay. 
Um, and then maybe we turn those off. So, cause you can't, it's the substance lags if you paint with the filters on. I'm not sure what color I'm going to make these like tufts of hair. But basically, make it a little darker, kind of in the base here. I already have a 3090, okay? I'm like mad that anything doesn't perform at maximum. I already have a 5900X and a 3090. Like, I don't want to get any more stuff. Then you just turn both of these on. That's how I feel about all the VTuber problems that I get. Do you guys see what I did there? I, I'm like using a blur to like help me make a sort of fake detaily fake gradient thing here while masking out so that the blur doesn't go outside of the inner ear. So the folder has a mask.
And if you and if any of it spills over, I just can make sure that it I just go like this. And if it turns out that the ears are slightly asymmetrical, because of course they are, then I can fix it really easily. We're getting somewhere. It's just taking a while. This is why I don't do texture commissions, because they take so much time. I mean, I enjoy doing it, but like... Furries be like, can you make a texture for me? I have 40 bucks. And I'm like, this is going to take six hours. <sighs> I like the blender work better, because people are like, I need face tracking. And I'm like, okay. Because I can, I can actually do Blender stuff faster. Yeah, texture commissions take a long time. I like how that looks. Do not boop me. I need to look at my other avatar for reference as to how I did this. Yeah, that's exactly what I think is that Blender is like, people ask me for texture commissions and I'm like, I don't really want to do that. And But somebody will ask me for a face tracking commission, I'll be like, yes, okay, here's my PayPal. Do not squish my face with tiger bee hands. All right.
Oh, I like the way that looks. What do you guys think? That looks that looks hot, right? I think it's coming together. This is gonna be nice. Yesterson, Yeseroni. I have way more than four Neo avatars. <laughs> I have way more. Honestly, okay. What if we did two streams today? What if I doubled down? And what I mean by that is, if we finish the texture and it is super duper hot, what if I did face tracking for this tonight as well? Would that be irresponsible? I should be, fl I should study flight stuff. Uh, that would be irresponsible, but I kind of want to do it. Do what I'm getting paid for. I have a couple commissions on deck right now. One of them, the guy is out of town. But you're right, I should do my commissions. Study playing dragon stuff. Alright, we have to check. Um, it's very common for ears. Dude, I love how the orthographic view makes me look thick. Perspective view? Thick view. <laughs> my, my thighs are powerful. Uh, I'm pretty happy with this. Just want to trim it off a little bit. Is it possible to mod people from chat? How do I do that? Let's see. Uh, there you go. Echo, you should be a chat mod now, since you're a mod in the Twitch chat. What do you guys think? Cringe or kind of, kind of plausibly cool looking? I think some of the painting is a little inconsistent, but that's okay. The hardest part is holding on to something, guarding 
Cause I can always like work on it later. Is he valid? I mean, look at that. Look at the adorable tummy right there. How could you not love this? Look how it fits inside of the jacket. Oh, that's just chef's kiss right there. finish it blizzball for the stream and then maybe like off stream i'll like you know get turbo on the small details let's work on that hair all right buster Now the question for the hair is, well, Doesn't want me to do that. So I might do the horns first because they're gonna be really simple. What do you mean you forgot your toilet seat broke? Shiny. All right, that's good for the horns now. If it if it turns out weird, I can change it later. But the horns are basically gonna be like a madcap or a singular color. So, um, 
You snapped the toilet in half? Dude, you got <laughs> That's funny. I'm sorry, but there's like no way to not laugh at that. All right, so the hair, uh, last time I textured hair, hmm, was on the shark, okay? Um, what I learned texturing on the hair is that you cannot do, doing multiple colors, well, let me see what I got going on here. We have, we have to, I'm, I'm learning myself some new things with every inch of every one of these models. Sure, Blizzball, whatever you say, dude. Okay, so let me show you guys something really quick. This is how the character looks. Uh, the, the default texture, all right? Now I'm noticing that basically it's one color with a couple highlights. So I might just try to emulate that by painting on it carefully. Um, deciding what the base color should be. I think it should be like a... I mean, my hair is... Like, look at the amp wave hair, right? So let's just make it like the amp wave hair. And maybe I'll try to add some highlights. And we could do the same with the, uh, with the horns. I'm just gonna, like, take that. I don't want to take this back to Blender, though. Uh, I don't want to do that. I've got... I, I did the UV. I redid the UV for the hair. So it's really easy. It's like here. I think. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna make this a little darker. And um, I'm thinking. Yeah.
TBH, I think that adding a little depth to this hair is not going to be that complicated. We just kind of make it brighter at the tips. Like that, that looks pretty good. And then I'll make it darker at the base, at the top, right? And we'll add a little blur effect. Um, and then maybe I'll add some highlights. But some of that, give me that slope blur. Oh, too much. Google, add another blur filter. Sir, you got a little bit of uh, dirty nonsense going on with your hair. Kind of looks like it has some depth. I kind of like how that looks. I just think the blur slope is too intense. That looks pretty good. Turquoise, yeah.
Hmm. That doesn't make any sense. Huh, weird. What's up, Chris Mini Game? Welcome. A hexagon on the hands? I don't think I'm gonna do that. Why is this blur like doing the opposite of what I think it does? That's good. You know what we could do, in theory? I don't know if it would really look good on like an anime kind of character or like a kimono character, but we could uh, bake ambient occlusion onto this. Blur directional is not helping me. In the past, it was really good when I did feathers, but on this, it's kind of whatever. Hello, Silver Wolf. Alright, should I try to add some highlights? Hmm. That's what I was doing, Blizzball, but I wanted to add a little blur too. the calligraphy tool yeah we're really going in depth on this character well symmetry mode is not gonna work for this
Ooh, I like how that works. Oh yeah, that's really satisfying. Maybe that shouldn't be like that kind of pink. What do you guys think of that? Pink! Oh, that's like perfect. Getting a little more artistic over here. This is going to be tasty. Neo, did you give yourself bright red? Did you give yourself bright red and pink uh, highlights? Yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> Well, it does have horns, but you're right, that does look like the horns, kinda. Huh. Well, oh well. Yeah, maybe I don't need the highlights because the horns are already like that.
decided I'm going to have, I'm going to simplify things a little bit. Because the emissives are already getting so complicated. I might come back and do highlights when like I feel more confident about them because right now I'm kind of kind of feeling eh about highlights. Especially because they're like the same as the horns. So I might just like come back for highlights another time. Not really feeling it. I think it could be cool, but I don't really want to try to figure that out right now. It has occurred to me that we might have a bizarre problem with our texture because of the way I did the UVs. Yep, uh, frick. I must have done the UV wrong for the hair. Whoops. Well, that's what I get. I'll just add some depth to the hair on this side. Not a big deal. Okay, fix that little problem. Hopefully that doesn't happen when I work on the eyes. If it does, then I don't know what I'm gonna do, Lamoa. Then it'll be, it is what it is. These are the inner eyes, so...
Um, trying to figure out what is the cause of, of this right here. Oh, it's the inner ear. Okay. Oh, it must be from the blur. Yep. Okay, that's easy to fix because I can just white mask it out. There we go. Cool. Yep. Uh, texturing is hard work and I really care about the details, so... Auto save. Beginning to look like a character. Might have to do some more work on that hair to make it really, really pop. But it's good enough in the short term. Honestly, just the brightness, the blatant brightness of it, I think is going to make me happy. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> All right. <sighs> Getting somewhere. Time for the heckin' schmeckles, the eyeballs. Now, the eyeballs, the eyeballs are kind of weird because they use um, back culling to, to work. Which, um, to be honest, I'm a little unsure what to do. I have to kind of figure it out as I go along. I knew this was going to be the trickiest part. blender to make sure to double check which eyes are which because the way these eyes work is they're like I 
Okay. So the top eyes are the are the default eyes. These are the main eyes. The other eyes are like expression eyes. So I think I'm gonna keep it simple this time and just give myself like cat eyes. And maybe I'll work out more complicated eyes in the future when I get a little better. Are you guys having fun out there? This is weird. Why is my painting ineffective. What the heck? See, painting eyes is bizarre. Whoa, my chat was frozen for a while and it just unfroze itself. These eyes are back cold eyes. So they're like inverted sort of. Um they're there's they're kind of strange.
A cutie pie? Nonsense. There's nothing like that here. Never ever. Plausible? Okay, that looks plausible, but the shape of the iris is not quite right. TBH, that right there is really close to my eyeballs. Welcome.
No. Wait, yes, actually. Uh, Lighthearted gifted some memberships earlier today. Some some hours ago. I'm so, I feel bad that this is taking so long, but I feel like people are vibing, so it's okay. What do you guys think? Like, I've only painted eyes from scratch a few times. I think that looks kind of pretty. Although I'm wondering if it looks good from other angles. These eyes, they might need to be inset more. Finding the like correct location for the eyes is difficult. So I'm like using the like example character as a reference and it's kind of like right here. difficult it's difficult to get it right on the money but I think that's pretty close Gaif, where is the love? Dude, where where is the love, man? That's what I'm asking. That's what I want to know. Where is the love? Okay, why can't I remove that one mark? Like, I can't draw on it for some reason. Question, what in the world are you talking about?
All right, I think that is kind of a plausible eyeball, if I do say so myself. Whew! How much time do I got left? Oh man, we're reaching the five hour mark. I need to speed up. Super speed. I'm glad you guys are Team Neo. It's nice to have a team. Okay, we've got a slight problem. This part of the UV might be shared. Or something. I'm gonna try to figure it out. Oh, yeah. Uh, frick, that's not good. This problem somewhere else on the model earlier. Um, I managed to fix it without going into Blender. Man, only a little bit is like that. remember I might I think I just painted on it in a different way I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Turn off symmetry mode. Yep. There we go. Yeah, I that was already doing that. It just kind of... There we go. Kinda.
Okay, yeah. Okay, turning off uh, symmetry mode and using the UV is what fixes it. Okay, cool. So, what I might do is... Um, uh, the other eyes you see here are for special expressions. And I might make those off stream just so we can get this going. Because I'm running out of time. So we're just, we'll just, I'll just finish those later. That's fair, right? Because then we can get it kind of going and you guys can see it. But then, like, I can, if I really like it, I'll add the expressions later. All right, look at him. What a pretty boy. What a good, good lad. I decided that part didn't look good. <sighs> yeah, that looks right. Okay, so we got the chest fluff. Uh, I'll be honest, I'm just gonna copy um, what's going on with the hair. I think the hair and the chest fluff should be like the same. Do you think it's a girl, Kate Reed? It could be a girl. That's weird. Hmm. Oh, I see. The texture set is not does not have a mission. There we go. That looks better. Somebody warned me when uh uh, when we get, cause like, uh, we're almost at the five hour mark. I want a warning at like the like half hour mark. If, if somebody would be so courteous. Because we can't, I don't want to do six, uh, get the six hour thing going again. YouTube will get mad at me.
Whew. What is this? I'm pretty happy with how this is coming out. All right, so for the clothes, I think I'm gonna get creative with the materials. I might do like a really simple clothing texture and then come back. Cause we could just make a layer. Let's find a material we'd like to go on the outside. Oh. That's kind of cool. Maybe I'll use that for the, the orbs. So like, um, put this on and then black mask. The little orbs, these things have physics. Ooh, that's cool. And I can change that for something else later, but in the short term, that's pretty cool.
With the clothing, I'm trying really hard to go fast. I can always change this for something later. Now the jacket zipper. I think we should use some steel for that or just silver. Whoa. Um, well, that's weird. I just noticed the jacket doesn't have an inner. It must be double sided in Unity, so I'm just going to hope that that comes out okay later. Yep, the jacket only has one side. Um, hopefully that's just fine later. See what else we got. Cool. All right. Hopefully this vest, uh, I put some nice materials on it and then it just kind of works out. Mm, you guys doing okay out there? Just want to make sure my chat isn't lagged out again. We're almost done. At least almost done with like the test version. I think I want to make work on it more later. I think that's too much.
Oh, we could make this dangerously shiny. That would be really funny. T is what I put in chat when I just want to make sure chat works. Now I just need something fluffy looking. Something soft for the fluffy white parts. Kind of like textureless. TBH, it might just be like add. How much time do we got left, guys? Keep me in the know. I'm, I'm going fast mode. Do not rush. Uh, I can always fix it later, but the stream has got to end within a certain amount of time. Otherwise, YouTube will be angry. Plus, I've got other stuff I want to do today. Twenty three until the five thirty mark. Okay, okay. As long as we end before six hours, I'll be happy. And then if there's any big problems, I'll just fix them later off stream.
What the heck? There we go. <sighs> Whew. Going crazy mode. There it is! We did it! Alright guys, what do you rate that? Ugh, I know I could have... I didn't do it very fast, but we have it. The original, the character is here. <sighs> do you guys think there's time to bring it into VR chat? I can certainly try. Punk Demon Neo. I'm gonna try. I have to export the modified version into Unity first. I just have to hope it's not gonna get mad at me. Okay, um... I'm gonna export the textures now. And then in, in, uh, in here, I'm just gonna say... Where's Unity? Alright, it's gonna take a minute for me to get everything crossed over. I want a 10 minute countdown every time, by the way, because I can't, I definitely do not want to go over. I could do more elaborate jacket designs and change other stuff later, but I just I want to get it like to a point where it's like kind of done. Okay, it's it's loading the stuff. You guys can't see it, but it's loading things right now.
That's a lot of stuff. I have to set up all the materials. Also, I need to make sure it doesn't go crazy in play mode. Oh, perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. Okay. Perfect. All I have to do is plug everything in and then it's good to go. I didn't change blush, so I hope that blush is just the same. If it's not, then I'll have to add a blush somehow. That's fine. Yes, yes it is, because I changed the UV of the character, so this is fine. See? I just have to plug everything in, then it'll be normal. Mmm, I kind of like this shader. It has occurred to me that I might need more materials. Because I've got the body, the eyes, the blush, the hair. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven materials. Oh no. I might be a, a little bit of an avatar, bad, unoptimal person with this model of all the materials but I'll lower the texture sizes to make up for it it's like one two three four five six seven I have special eyes. Look at, look how pretty the eyes are. Ah, body full. Yeah, a little bit. I'll lower the texture sizes of some of the stuff. It'll be fine. Looking cool, Joker! Yeah, 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 yeah. We're getting there, we're getting there. We're getting somewhere. My ear is bubbling.
I think that's correct. Something's not right. Okay. It's coming together. Yes! Yeah! Uh, so basically for everything that's not the body, I'm gonna reduce the texture size as much as possible because I don't want to annihilate people with my materials. That is not nice to do. That looks right, I think. TBH, it doesn't even need a texture, but... Lol. <laughs> Whatever. In the, in the future, I can give it a little gradient or something. But for now, I'll just keep it the same. Uh, is that everything? Oh, that looks weird. Why is... What is that? Oh, uh, some of the metal map from before must be left over. The madcap, here it is, a madcap mask. Um... Where's the metal map? We had a metal map for the body. This will work. Ew, no, that's not right. Uh, that's also wrong. I only want the beans to be shiny, so I'm not really sure what to do here. Looks good. Uh, yeah, except I'm not gaming. I'm making myself into a kimono. A little dude. Check him out. He's pretty cool, right? Alright, that is, um, I think the wings I should make a little darker or something. I don't know. Hmm. Five and a half now.
overall, I think that I want to add more details to the tail. I want to do more details on the jacket and the wings and the the anklet things and the balls are kind of like a little last minute thing. Uh, the rest of it I'm really happy with. I'd like to make a mask for the beans to make the beans shiny. And besides that, it's like perfect. I see a couple little weird, weird, weird spots. All right, let's upload it. Oh yeah, I should probably reduce some of the texture sizes besides the body and the body emission. Uh, to be courteous to others. So what I'll do is like everything through here. Um, we'll set the max size to 512 and crunch compression. That will make the avatar less of a crime to other people in VR chat. I say less because it's still got a lot of materials and stuff. But like the only part that really needs the super fine details are uh maybe the eyes actually. I'll change the eyes back to 2k. And now it's ready. I don't know what that means. Uh, I think Unity is thinking right now. So I will basically, I'm going to like upload this and then I'm going to get in VR. I'm going to start all my VR stuff now, actually. It's a sheep. I mean, I maybe kinda. Unity's loading. Now, if we're unlucky, um, then VR chat will not receive my avatar in the system. Uh, very quickly, which would suck. How much time do we got left? That's cause I am the goat. Oh my god, that was a lot of work. Okay, it's successfully uploaded. I'll be right back while I switch to VR chat. Hopefully it's just in there.
Hello? Okay, VR. VR chat is being super slow to load. Um, like, I'm just loading my home world, and it's, like, not loading. Bubbles, I just textured a crazy avatar. Connection to VR chat timed out. Oh, come on. I want to show this off. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Ah. You guys can hear me, right? Whoa. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, okay, okay. This world kind of dark. You guys can see, right? If there's time, I'll go somewhere brighter. So here's... Here's what it used to look like. Oh, let me... Can you guys see everything? Here's what the model looks like by default. Which is good, you know, it's good, it's good. But here's what we look like. Here's what it looks like with my texture. Hopefully it loaded. Oh, yes, it's here. Okay. Sometimes. Ooh. Check that out. Oh my god, yes! <laughs> yes! I love it! It's like almost perfect. I could see some things I would change a little bit, little, little changes, but... Oh my god, it's brilliant. Nezuku, thanks for the, thanks for the, thanks for becoming a cute star. I'm going to see if there's time. I'm going to go to a brighter world. How much time? Tiefling Neo? Yeah. Mr. Bubbles, what do you think? Wow, so pretty. It looks really good. Was it worth spending six hours on this? Oh my god, and probably a little bit more time. Dude, it'll probably take me less time to make the face tracking. Let's be real. Okay, okay. I'm gonna go outside. Uh, 23 minutes? Okay, we're good, we're good. But yeah, this is it. I mean, obviously I can make some changes. But... This is certainly one of the textures of all time that I think I've come out with. I noticed I got a little bit of paint on the beans, but that's an easy fix. I must have messed up somewhere. 
Ah, oh, the fish are in my way. Hi. Um. Ooh. I remember I didn't. Oh yeah, the blush. So the blush is messed up. Uh, I'll have to figure that out. And the angry is messed up. But I'll figure it out. It'll be okay. The clothes are toggleable. So yeah, I need to I need to figure out the expressions because they they require custom textures basically. Um, as for the clothes. This is what I look like without them. What do you think? Is the hair toggleable? No, it's not. <laughs> It's the Ferna. Um, you can find it in the description. But yeah, I think that's everything I want to do today. I might work on this some more later. Pretty happy with how this came out. Uh, there's a couple little quirks about it. Maybe some other details I want to add. I need The eyes and expressions need to be worked on. But I'll do it in my free time. I need to do some work now, so... Really cute cat demon. That's that's exactly right. I've decided to upgrade to to pure evil. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's it. I'm gonna end now. Uh, if you guys are like, you know, uh, new and stuff, I I stream more often on Twitch still. Um, and we also have a Discord. Everything important you need to know about me is in the description of most videos that I do. So all that stuff is there. Love you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I didn't expect this to take six hours, but I don't regret it. It was pretty cool. I'm going to work out and study flight stuff and clean my room and sort out some things. For those of you waiting on commissions, I'll be hard at work on it um, this week whenever I'm not doing flying stuff. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>